Hi everybody, Robin here from Robin's Pygmies. Um, today you're going to see a video uh, from one of my my goats, Bra. He had a seizure while I was out cleaning one of the pens. And Bra, <laughs> I've done a lot of research on why he does this. It's a rare condition in goats. I I felt horrible when it, because I think that it was my fault that he did this because I didn't remove him from the pen because he seems to do it when um, he gets startled or frightened about something. But I think what his condition is, I've done a lot of research, I think the condition is caused from metabolic acidosis I believe and what that means is um, that his body isn't producing uh, the biocarbonate that he needs to digest everything in his stomach uh, goats have four compartments in their stomach and they produce their own Basically, biocarbonate is uh, baking soda. They produce their own by burping it back up and their rumen and swallow it back down and, you know, process it through their body, just like deer and horses and cows. And he doesn't seem to be doing that. And I think he's lacking um, certain minerals and... Um, baking soda or basically biocarbonate. So what am I going to do to fix that? I am going to um, put free choice baking soda in his pen. We obviously we keep him in a pen with two other weathers. He is a weather, a castrated male. He reduce his stress level. We already do that by separating him when we feed him. We take him out of the pen and put him in his own little pen so he doesn't, pen, pen, sorry. So he doesn't compete for his food. Um, he always has fresh water available to him. We replace his water twice a day and provide him, of course, with free choice minerals. So, I think by providing him with some free choice biocarbonate, it may help his situation. So anyway, that's what we're going to try to help improve his stress level too. So that's what we're going to do today. In the summertime, they just dig into the dirt and make a hole and lay in the, in the dirt, and they like that. So, but in the wintertime, they like to use the hay for bedding, keeps them warm. Now they have. They don't get cold, really. They have a nice, thick undercoat that they grow that's woolly underneath their fur, and they shed it out in the spring. So they uh, don't really, they can withstand some pretty cool temperatures. out sometimes I put my fingers down into their their coat and they are so warm under that coat I mean it warms your finger when your fingers start to freeze you can put your fingers down in their coat and it warms your fingertips up it's amazing amazing you guys are nice and warm under that coat aren't you <laughs> they do not need heat lamps or anything like that. 
I mean, maybe a newborn. You don't give them heat lamps. For one, it causes a bonfire. It gets too warm. They will lay under them. Okay, buddy. You okay? Huh? Yeah? It's okay, Ra. Come here, bud. Come here, Ra. Come here, Ra. Oh, come here, buddy. It's alright. Come here, Ra. 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 Come here, Ra. Come here, buddy. Come here. You'll be fine, bud. Yes. There you go, Ra. There you go. Come here, Ra. 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 Okay, bud. Come here, 
buddy. I know, you're going to be fine. There you go. Okay. He's got to kind of reorient himself. Yes, Ra, you're going to be fine. had a seizure. Do you want to come in and talk to him? He seems to respond better to you. Yeah. You're cleaning. He needs to be out there. And... So I've removed everything from in the pen that... So he needs to be isolated out there. Well, he, he needs you, I think. If he's not responding to me. <laughs> uh, he's got to get over the yeah. How you feeling, buddy? Are you feeling better? Yes, you're feeling so much better. I feel better, Ma. Yes, you're a good boy, Ra. You're such a good boy. Just like new. Just like new. Yeah. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. I don't know what overcomes me, Ma. I just sit down. Things happen. Hang on, buddy. So this is the area where we put raw, we separate them when we feed him, but the other weathers Ha also have access they can we have a gate where we can lock them in here or they can come in here from their pen so I'm going to put this uh, this feeder pan in here attach it to uh, the hog panel fencing here we and put and then I'll put and I'll put baking soda on one side and minerals on the other. So baking soda on one side and loose minerals I'm going to put on the other side for him. So, and this is his, his dish, so he comes in here. So, what am I doing? I can see you. <laughs> So, there we have that, and this is the weather pin here, and we have a gate here that we open up this pin, and then we have another gate here that we can shut, and then we have another gate here, and this gate actually comes around here where we can lock him in and this gate and then this gate opens up to here 
also we can let these guys come in into this area and not go into that area. So it's, it's kind of like a and this goes outside so they can come in and go that way. So it's kind of like a three way gate system. Isn't that right kids? So you can see how it's set up there. See he's waiting. That's Ra. And he's waiting to be fed so that'll work out nicely for him. And they can ha also have access to the minerals and the baking soda. And they can also have another area they can get outside on that side. So we have two gates going outside there and there. You guys are spoiled. <laughs> so there you go. Are you right, waiting for dinner, buddy? Huh? Are you waiting for dinner? It's coming. It's coming. So I'm gonna do your water, and you're gonna get some, you're gonna get some food. So you just gotta wait a minute, okay? It's coming. Yes, it's coming. Hang on. We're going to let you in there. So I'm going to lock this gate. We'll let Rod, Ra, Ra, do you want to come in? There you go, dude. All right. Okay, Ra's ready for dinner. <laughs> Since I got my own dish of minerals, I'm happy. Looks like our mineral feeder is a huge success over there. All the boys are coming out to enjoy it. You okay, Ra? Huh, buddy? He's running around in the weather pen now. The other boys came out and Decided they wanted some minerals. Just what they wanted. They needed that. So I've been putting minerals in their hay feeder. But obviously they needed more than what I was giving them. 